A week ago, Khalistan terrorist Gurpan Singh Pannun issued a serious threat, highlighting a grave danger to Air India on 19 November 2023. Pannun declared that Air India's traffic will come to a halt on 19 November, the very same day when the final of the ICC Cricket World Cup will be held. He also advised six to refrain from flying that day, citing a global blockade. In response to this threat, Delhi's IGI airport and all Punjab airports were instructed not to issue temporary visitor entry passes until November 30, as reported by sources. The security measures clearly reflected the seriousness with which authorities are treating Pannun's threat and their commitment to safeguarding against potential risk to air travel during the specified period. However, despite the efforts, the video continued to circulate widely on social media. Now Canada, which is home to the largest Sikh diaspora globally, has responded after nearly a week. The country's federal police is investigating online warnings by Pannun against flying Air India on November 19. The ongoing probe was confirmed by the Transport Minister Pablo Rodriguez on the behalf of Canadian government. Following Gurpon Singh Pannun's video urging Sikhs to avoid Air India, Canada pressed it is committed to take every threat seriously. Both the Canadian government and the Royal Canadian Mounted Police have initiated an investigation into potential terror threat, reflecting the nation's proactive stance in addressing security concerns. Simultaneously, the Indian government has retaliated its condemnation of Pandun's threat, emphasizing its serious consideration of the matter. In the Bakchi, the MEA spokesperson not only condemned the action, but also in a more subdued tone, retaliated concerns about Canada harboring terrorists. Look, we strongly condemn such terrorist threats. Uh, I do not wish to get into details, it just gives visibility to that. We have been engaged with foreign governments on the activities of radical and terrorist elements that have been inciting violence and intimidation of our leadership, of our diplomats. We will continue to press these governments to deny space to such extremist elements. Let me limit it to that. We will certainly take necessary security measures against that. The ongoing India-Canada rift further complicates the matter. Canada-India diplomatic ties soared after Prime Minister Justin Trudeau accused India in September of involvement in the June killing of Khalistan separatist Hardeep Singh Nidjar in Surrey, Canada. Responding to Trudeau claims, India temporarily halted visa issuance to Canadians and requested Ottawa to scale down his diplomatic presence for parity. While India has since resumed issuing four types of visa for Canadians, lingering tensions persist in the bilateral relationship. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.